The other day I was chatting with my friends about taking the COVID-19 vaccines. Although we all are relatively young and do not have any underlying diseases, some of my friends said that the doctors have advised them to not take COVID-19 vaccines. I asked them, but why? I think by now most of you have guessed. Yes, they are allergic to some drugs, pollen grain, and some have allergies due to unknown reasons. Then I wondered, these untreated allergies not only cause us discomfort in our daily life, but can also deprive us from taking life-saving vaccines. Hello everyone, my name is Mukesh Kumar and from the past 4 years, I have been working on the development of new drugs to treat allergies. In modern days, being exposed to several drugs and different kind of food products, we are more prone to get allergies. For instance, in Hong Kong, allergies have been reported as a fast-growing disease with a high burden on pediatric population. In the US, allergies are the sixth leading cause of chronic illness affecting over 50 million Americans every year. Well, if allergies are such common and prevalent, what are the treatment options we have? We have some drugs available, however, all these drugs treat only the symptoms of allergies. Unfortunately, they do not treat the root cause of allergies. So allergies come back again. Therefore, now it is very important to develop new drugs which can target the root cause of allergies. As our understanding of allergies is evolving, researchers have found a new protein which is the root cause of allergies. Let's imagine, this protein is like a lock and my research aim was to develop new drugs which are like the key. Similar to a lock, this protein has a specific area to fit with the key. To start with, I have identified the specific area of this protein, the lock, and designed thousands of drug molecules which are like the key. Secondly, I tested these molecules whether they could fit to the lock or not. I have shortlisted the six best drug molecules as a key and then synthesized them in the lab. Lastly, I tested these molecules on human cells and on animal model of allergies. Among six drug molecules, one molecule is not only reducing the inflammation and the scratching behavior in the mice, but also significantly inhibiting the root cause of allergies. I have identified the key for the allergic lock and now would strive to work toward opening the door of new therapeutic options for all of us. The fight against allergies does not need to be lifelong and definitely should not deprive anyone from taking life-saving vaccines. Thank you very much.